Hello guys, Keith White on TV here, back for yet another video. Before we get into today's video, let's see if we can hit 100 likes. And as well, if you haven't dropped the sub, make sure to smash that subscribe button. So, I did a video last night talking about um, we was in negotiations with Steve Cooper, but apparently now the nego negotiations have broken down. And now we are in talks with Sunderland, former Sunderland and West Brom manager and Blackburn manager, Tony Mowbray. He is he's probably going to be announced in the next couple of days. Tony Brownbray to Birmingham City. Talks have begun, um, and you know, that that is a fact. Um, I've seen, you know, there's there's, there's quite a few um, outlets saying it. So yeah, Tony Mowbray, would I be happy with this appointment if it does happen? Now, of course, we we went through hell the last three months with Wayne Rooney in charge. Tony Mowbray's got a good CV. He done well at Blackburn, I believe. He got them um, promoted from League One as champions, and then there was pushing on for the playoffs the following season. And I believe he got Sunderland promoted from League One in the player final as well. Um, and then the following season, into that in, their, in Sunderland's first season back in the Championship, he got them in the, into the playoffs. I think he was harshly sacked this season for Sunderland. You know, he was sacked. He only he only lost like one out of six or seven games. And I've been, it, you know, I want to know if there's any Sunderland fans watching this. Let, let me know what if you can comment down below because I've seen some, I've seen some Sunderland fans. Um, that saying, you know, he was harshly sacked. They played brilliant football under him. I remember when they played us, and when we had Wayne Rooney in charge, it was his first, like it was like his first couple of games uh, into his first couple of games, and they absolutely completely, they completely battered us. They beat Southampton five 0 as well, by the way. Southampton, they beat them five 0 at home. Tony Mowbray, yes, he got re relegated with West Brom in the Premier League in 2009, but I do think this would be a really, really good appointment f uh, for Blues. He plays great football. Um, he's got a lot. He's got a lot of um, experience in the game. You know, he's managed loads and loads of clubs. He's been around for a long time, and I think Tony Mowbray will keep us up. Definitely, he'll definitely keep us up. I'm not too sure if this is going to be an interim on an interim basis or or a long term. Um, or is it going to, it's going to be a long term contract? Now it's going to be interesting to see if the, if it actually is on a permanent basis and how many years are the, how many years is the contract going to be? But yeah. I will be delighted. I wanted Steve Cooper as my number one choice, but that looks like it's not going to happen now. But yeah, Steve Cooper, um, not Steve Cooper, sorry, Tony Mowbray. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. From what I've seen, Blues from Blue, what from what I've seen, um, Blues fans seem a bit split on this appointment if it does happen. But yeah, anyway, it's been Keep Watch on TV. Make sure to like, share, and also subscribe to the channel. Oh yeah, by the way, it's my four year channel anniversary. Four years on YouTube, nearly half a decade. That's crazy, yeah, so thank you guys for your support on the channel, it means a lot. And um, yeah, as always, keep right on. Let's hope we can actually appoint um, a new manager in the next couple of days. Keep right on.